We've arrived at our apartment in Vila Mora. It was quite the adventure to get here. We left Lagos about 8.30 in the morning from an 8.30 bus and then connected in uh, Albufera on a second bus, which we thought would be a pretty quick bus, but had a lot of stops on Saturday morning. So a lot of people on the bus, who we are more than ready to get off the bus, got here to Vila Mora and uh, our apartment wasn't very easy to find. We didn't even know if we were in the right spot, but long story short, it took us another hour that was only like a five minute walk to find our place. Uh, it was very difficult because Google Maps said that we were there and we weren't. <laughs> so luckily we found the place. So we wanna give you an apartment tour before the explosion opens up from our suitcases. <laughs> That's why Lagos never happened because we, um, didn't make the video at the beginning. So we decided to make the video at the beginning here to give you um, just a taste of what our apartment is like here in Villa Morta. Uh, so here's the front door and I will just give you the tour from the front door. So you can see walking in the front door, the mirror there, you can see me, hi. <laughs> then it goes right to the bathroom here, but I'm gonna take you to the bedroom. Um, I have yet to unpack the suitcase, um, but um, and that's why I wanted to do the video first. So you can see here we have some French, kind of French doors, I guess, for the closet. Very nice we have the space because the bedroom really isn't that big. But it looks like everything is going to be pretty nice. We have the nightstands on either side of the bed and it's a really nice touch that they have soap and shampoo for us and towels. So we got this on Airbnb. It's not a hotel. Uh, it's an apartment that they're renting out on Airbnb. And I, I feel like we got a really good deal on the apartment. We're gonna be here for a month. There's a TV here in the bedroom. So um, lucky, uh, luckily enough to have a window as well. There's no terrace off of this window, but there's one from the living room. So that's the bedroom. We have some shelves underneath the TV to put our stuff away. Since it is so compact, we will definitely be unpacking. And since we're here for the month, you know, to unpack and put things away. So then the bathroom, pretty nice bathroom, shower, sink, bidet, toilet, um, nice like, modern feel, which is great. Looks like the, it has a rain shower head, so we're pretty excited about that. And then walk into the dining area. Now, this is really nice. We do have a separation here, this door, so it's, Really beautiful, it's very well done. It's a, I can tell it's an older complex, but it's very stable and nice. So we have our dining room table and, <laughs> hello! <laughs> and a mirror, so again, lots of cupboard space. They provided us with blankets, so that's great. Then our kitchen, so we had a little bit of an explosion. We actually had an accident in our, um, and our backpack where we had some olive oil that we brought from salad go all over the place but um, this is the kitchen it does have a dishwasher and one of my favorite things that I love when I travel is to have a washing machine so it's great it's a very nice little kitchen and refrigerator so then we come into the living room here we have a nice size divan nice sized couch this is really important for us to feel comfortable um, the two of us on a couch and then we have TV fireplace uh, So it's really nice and then here we have you know some nice art more shelves and uh, Then this is our terrace, so we don't have a view to anything except for some really beautiful trees <laughs> and Some other buildings, but we're pretty close to um, the marina to walk around. We'll definitely give you videos of walking around and that's our terrace so overall, we're really pretty happy with the apartment. Um, it is small, but it's, uh, it, it has everything that we need and we'll be here for one month. We don't know yet where we're going to go after that. Um, we're, we will most likely go to Lagos again, or if we find some amazing deal to head over to Madeira or the Azores, but um, we, most likely will not be staying longer than a month in Villamora. From the first impression, we really like Lagos better. 
Um, we kind of suspected that, but this apartment was, we actually booked this apartment before we even went to Lagos. So uh, we have to come and fulfill <laughs> our time here at this apartment in Villa Mora. But I'm sure it's, I'm expecting it to be a nice stay. So it looks like there's a lot of places to walk to here in Villa Mora and a lot of paths, uh, beautiful places to, to walk. And we chose, we also chose this apartment because there's a pool nearby. So hopefully I can find that pool and we can get swimming and um, between our working online, we can have our walks and swim and get a lot of work done here is what I'm hoping. So that is our apartment in Villa Mora and I'm gonna leave it here so I can start unpacking and getting everything organized. Plus get something to eat because we haven't eaten yet today. So ciao for now. I'm wishing you a high vibe day, high vibe moments and high vibe activities. Ciao.